Hi guys, welcome back to this series on machine learning with Android. So today we are going to add one more option in our ML series demonstrator app, which is here at the bottom. You can see the icon at the bottom, visitor analysis. So basically it's a demonstration uh, demonstrator for uh, age and gender analysis of the people that are walking in or whose faces you are capturing. It might be using a security cam or a camera at the entrance of a shop or a mall. Basically what it does is it combines the face detection of uh, machine learning kit given by Google along with some custom TensorFlow models uh, built on this UTK face data set and they try to predict the, uh, the gender and age along with the uh, you can say smiling non-smiling which we get from machine learning kit basically we have combined three models to come up with a visitor analysis now this analysis can be used for different purposes like doing a visitor analysis and combining it with sales data to see how the uh, visitor corresponds to the sales data whether you are having more happy customers or more sad customers so you can see here uh, we have total faces one smiling 100 percent now if we change the photo we have Two people now you can see male is one female is two all three are smiling and then when we go to the third foot we have two more people here now. So basically you can track what all people are visiting your store or an area uh, whether they are happy or not happy that's an option but what is the demographic of that uh, people that are visiting how many kids are there how many adults are there how many youngsters are there how many aged people are there plus uh, you can always have the total count and you can always have that as a metric. So a lot of implications with this. We have added this code to the same ML series demonstrator. It is up in the GitHub, uh, which will be linked in the description. About the model, the model has been trained on UTK phased uh, large scale phase data set. Basically it has uh, a lot of photographs around 20,000 plus. And then they have the age, gender, race, or ethnicity and the date time and on, on which uh, moment this uh, data was captured now i didn't do it on my own i took help from some github uh, sources so basically this is a github uh, you can say demonstrator app from shubham basically he uh, has done age and gender estimation in android with tensorflow so i've just combined it with my uh, ml series demonstrator he has actually much more models uh, around uh, four types of models that he has generated. I have just used the light one. Uh, maybe the other ones are more accurate. If you want to know more about his uh, profile and the other projects that he has done, I will leave a link in the description. So coming back to the uh, app that we are talking about now, or just the use case that we are talking about is the visitor analysis. So basically we just take any image as an input. We run it through Google ML kit face detection. Uh, like before and we bring out the face okay we crop the face from the input image now ml kit will give us the face as well as the smiling probability which we will use later and then we will use this face and we will pass it to the age estimation model as well as gender estimation model to get the age and gender now if we go to the code uh, so this is the new processor that I have written. I've also simplified the vision based processor and uh, removed a lot of files to make it easier for you to understand. So in all what we're doing is we have a video helper activity like before, uh, which helps us to capture the video and it has a text view and a preview uh, view on the top. And uh, it just provides, uh, initializes the camera and passes the camera to the processor. Uh, it just takes care of uh, drawing the overlay also so that everything is in sync. Now that itself is quite complicated, but we are just going to focus on the uh, model part now. So how we can do age and just age and gender estimation along with uh, and by combining these two, we can just do visitor analysis. So now we have this age gender estimation processor. Uh, at the start, what we do is we initialize all those models. So basically we have an age model. We have a gender model and our own face detector model or face detector from the ML kit. So here you can see we have also done classification mode all. This will ensure that we get the smiling probability. 
if you don't do this the smiling probability won't be available in the uh, detected phase now once this is done uh, we and as soon as we get the input image or image proxy from the camera this code will be triggered we will check whether the image is rotated or not and then once the rotation is factored in we will run the face detector on that so once we run the face detector the ml kit will return us a list of faces so basically on success is called if nothing we will have uh, this on failure so once we have the faces we will find all the faces and then we will actually crop them or you when you are running this up you can actually uncomment these three lines and then you will see the image of the face on top of the uh, app itself so here the face will be cropped and shown it is just to verify whether we are actually cropping the face or not so once we have the face uh, we check the tracking id so we also enable tracking if you see here uh, we have enabled tracking in the detector options this will ensure that we don't analyze and add the same face again and again so we don't count the same person again and we don't analyze that face and age again and again so once we have the cropped bitmap we then pass it we convert it to a tensor image because the other models are tensor models and then we pass it to both age model as well as gender model interpreters now once we have that data we combine everything and we send it back to our visitor analysis here if you see it will get all the faces and we are also maintaining a tracking id set so basically we also don't want to count the faces again and then we just build the text output and show it so very simple if you just follow the code very simple to understand uh, not too complex by combining google ml kit along with custom tensorflow model we will, are able to do age and gender estimation and we are able to build a use case which can be called visitor analysis so this can be a standalone app on its own which you can sell to the storefront and which they can use to classify the data for their own usage so hope you enjoy if you have any comments or questions please do leave them i'll try to get back to you thank you for watching